the last four years my team is trying to realize how cells communicate and talk to each other. Basically for many years uh, researchers cultured cells on two dimensions and explored their electrophysiology in, in two dimensions. We are trying to uh, explore electrophysiology in a native-like state in 3D. This is where the spheroids come into play. So we are trying to come up with an approach that will allow us to look into cell communication in a benign way uh, uh, in three dimensions. In order to do so, we developed this platform. This platform goes beyond just recording electrical signals in 3D. What we are currently interested in is essentially the, the ability to follow how electrophysiology changes over time. This is, a, a, in essence, looking into development, tissue development. So if you start with embryonic-like tissue, we want to see uh, how the uh, properties change as, as time goes. So more like a time-lapse experiment. Other techniques give um, snapshots of, of, of the state of a tissue. We want to look at it continuously. Uh, we want to see if we can affect this tissue. And we form in, uh, input output with this tissue and send in uh, signals and, and see how does it affect the development. We want to develop this and extend this, I have to admit, to different types of tissues and look into developing different types of tissues such as brain uh, tissue uh, or neural uh, spheres essentially. We want to look into toxicity, drug screening using this platform so it goes way beyond just recording 3D. The way I see it in the future, other labs will be able to prepare these devices or these platforms and use it for their own research. Essentially everything will be shared with them so they can make these devices and use these ideas to answer questions within their own realm, I have to admit, so they can dig in biology using self-rolled sensors. The biggest challenge we are facing now is to take the platform and let it stay in culture for a prolonged time and still keep a fun, fully functional high channel count for a month, two months, up to a year, let's say. Recording signals in 3D uh, will have impact on human health, uh, such as uh, disease investigation or drug development.